So this one is our standing calf stretch. So again, we can use a set of books or you can use a bumper plate or you can use a wedge. It doesn't really matter. We just want something that's going to elevate the toe higher than the heel and it's going to get our foot into Darcy flexion. So once we're here, we want the heel firmly on the ground and we're going to manipulate our center of mass around our foot to amplify the stretch. So if you're really tight through the calves, just being in this position might be enough of a stretch for you. If you feel that you can progress past this, what you want to try and do is you want to try and get your hip in line with your heel or even beyond it if you can. And the more that you can lean forward and manipulate your center of mass in front of your leg, then the more you want to amplify the stretch. You want to lock your knee out, you want to fully extend your hip and lock your glute out as well. And really focus on getting that really nice stretch and putting some length through your heel cords and through the calf. So that is your standing calf stretch.